All right, just finished with my workout and I thought to share protein shake recipe with you. So this protein shake is around 800 calories. So if you're on the weight loss journey, so it's definitely not for you, but if you struggle to put muscles and add some size, so it could be perfect solution for you. So this particular protein shake have more than 60 grams of protein and obviously fat and carbs which will help you to add some more size. I will add the proper breakdown and the calories at the end of the video. Why would you like to have so many calories? Well, the main reason is if you're a hard gainer or struggling to put on size or muscles, you probably don't get enough calories in your diet. So the liquid calories might be a good solution for you because it's much easier to consume. Also can be very convenient on the go. So if you have some things going on and you don't have time for a meal, protein shake can be a good solution for you to get this extra calories in your diet. Okay, we're gonna start with the ingredients. What do we need for the job? We need banana, peanut butter or almond butter, whatever you have. So I have peanut butter, so I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna use about 50 grams of peanut butter. Then oats, so just normal oats. I have over here 40 grams of oats. Some sort of liquid, it could be water or milk, whatever you prefer. So sometimes I use skim milk, Sometimes I use coconut milk, whatever you have, whatever you prefer, so it's up to you. But if you add in any other milk, let's say, just make sure you count the calories into that as well. And the last and main ingredient is protein powder. So I'm using bulk whey protein powder. It's chocolate and coconut flavor. You can use anything you like. If you have different flavor, if you prefer different flavor, you can use that. You need a blender for that as well, so just any blender. If you don't have blender, I'm afraid you have to chew everything. Okay, let's begin. Water goes in, then peel banana. Goes into the blender. Oats go in. Peanut butter, so the scoop would be 50 grams. I measured it before, so I know that it's roughly 50, 55 grams. Next, protein goes in. So I'm adding two scoops of protein, 30 grams of protein each. So all in. All goes in. Okay, so now over here we have around 800 calories. I'll put the proper breakdown on the screen so you know how many calories, protein, fat and carbs in this shape. So you can make adjustments if you need to. Tastes really good. All right, hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you soon. Bye for now.